Hi boys and girls. Today we're going to draw a shape cat. This is something I've worked with kindergartners on, but this is also something that all grades could work on. Um, today I'm just going to use a pencil and paper, but if you choose to add color to your picture, I would love to see. Draw a shape cat. The first thing I would do would be to start with an oval shape. So on my paper, I'm going to draw oval for the cat's body. Okay. Next, after drawing the oval, I'm going to add a circle for the head. Okay, after I add a circle for the head, I'm going to give the cat its legs. I'm going to start with a rectangle and then add an oval for the paw. One, two, three, and four. This one I'm going to just draw part of it since it will be in front of the other one. After that, I'm going to give my cat its triangle ears. One, two. For the tail, I can make it straight. I can make it curved. My cat's tail kind of is curved like this right now, so I'm going to add a curved line and then bring it back to the body. After I make the shape for the cat, the next step is I'm going to add the details. So I'm going to add a nose with a triangle shape pointing down. Then I'm going to add the letter W for the mouth. Then I'm going to add a circle for the eye here. And the cat's eyes, their pupils, which is the part of the eye that open and closes with light, are actually more like an oval shape like this. They can get big or small too. And if you make it too big, just change it and make it into something else just like we've talked about in class many times. Okay, so I'm gonna give the eyes and then I'm gonna make sure I give my cat some spots here where the whiskers grow and then add some whiskers. This helps the cat to know where it can jump. I'm going to add the inside of the ear, maybe add a little shading there. And then I'm going to give my cat a furry texture. I think I'm going to add some stripes to my cat before I give him a furry texture. Okay, and I'm going to add some lines to give my cat a furry texture. And then I'm going to also show where my cat lives. So I think my cat is going to be a cat that lives in outer space. He's going to be a cat that is dreaming. So he's going to be on maybe on a planet in outer space and maybe behind him I'll draw a planet. Maybe there'll be a moon back here. Maybe another planet further away back here. Maybe another one here. Maybe add some stars in the background. And there you go. Okay, boys and girls, here is our shape cat. And then again, you can do this at home. You can use whatever colors you would like. I would love to see the work that you create using your shapes. Um, if you are able to, you can either um, on your own or ask a parent or guardian to help you upload your picture to our media album, which is on the continuity of learning folder in your art um, course in Schoology. Okay. Boys and girls, I it was so nice to see you, and I hope to see your art soon. Bye.